All right. right. Thank you. you. Can do a, uh, intro whenever you feel like it. So you're the boy that that is going to start the show. Woo! <laughs> Here we go. Everyone's dead. Oh man! Oh man! Jeez! I guess after you killed that guy, they were just like, "Oh, this yeah, cult's this... bogus. You're not gonna open that present." No, you don't need it. Oh, it's Porgy. What a horrible nightmare! I somehow woke up. Ness, let's be friends again. Please answer me. No. I promise to be good. Uh, okay. Then he just runs away. <laughs> so like slowly. <laughs> so what was the cult doing exactly? Ah, oh, I lied. see you, sucker. He's an asshole still. Yeah, Porgy's. A he big never. Asshole. He never redeems himself. So, um, what was the cult trying to do? They force everyone to be happy. That, that <laughs> doesn't sound that bad. What, why, why did he say he woke up from a horrible nightmare, though? Because like, his brain was... I guess you killing the cult leader made everybody realize that they weren't happy, and therefore they because didn't want to be Because people have a right to be anymore. Yeah, you have, a, you have to fight back the happiness sometimes. Let the hate consume you. Should everyone have a right to be depressed? Let the darkness. Oh, yeah, I, I yes. think so. Let me. Uh, <laughs> oh, Trevor. Let, let the hurt? resident yes, depression yes, expert. Are you hurt? <laughs> yes. No. I'm sorry I caused all the trouble for you. Psychoanalyze. Key to the cabin. Key to the cabin. I actually didn't know that her audio. Thank you, Ness. You're just like I imagined you would be. I'm sure that some people in Tucson are worried about me. Getting back there may be dangerous, no but cares. we can do it if we combine our strengths. Yeah, let's combine our strengths. I'm ah! going to use a little psychic power that is actually pretty deadly. Yeah. Oh, God. Let's head back to Tucson. <laughs> deadly. Oh, yeah, we got the teddy bear, too. Yay. Teddy bears. Does she follow you around like Pikachu? Yep. It's wonderful. Also. Wonderful. Did he joined you. Yeah, Yay! the teddy bear too. All right. It's a, that serves as like a decoy, right? Yeah. I'm assuming she's dragging it. Oh around. God, here he comes. Yep. Here he oh, is. Oh snap! Yeah! It's you. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, fuzzy pickles. Fuzzy, fuzzy pickles. pickles. <laughs> wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Hey, Trevor, you should cosplay as him for Otakon. I feel like uh, Victor should cosplay as him. And just jump over the railings at times and take pictures. Oh, God. <laughs> Say fuzzy pickles. Hands by your ankles. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I really want to do this kite cosplay, but it's going to... Take some time. Cost you some money. Yeah, because he wears like a. You know the shoes Walter White wears in Breaking Bad? He wears Clark's Wallabies. And do, that's. What... Do you really have to get specific shoes? Yeah, because they're brown Wallabies. with like white soles. And, yeah, uh... If you're going to do it, you're going to do it right. You yeah, could exactly. Just, like, paint the bottom of something. The fuck do like, I look garbage? like? Does he look like an artist? Get some vans and fucking. Some color vans. Them. <laughs> that's all they're good for, right? Is coloring them? I don't know. I don't wear vans. So. That's what you do is you get vans because they come in like every imaginable color and then you draw all over them. Every imaginable color. Even ones I can, you can imagine, imagine some colors, man. Like fucking fourth dimension colors. Ugh, I think I just imagined it. <laughs> A fourth dimension color. That's what you say. Was it ugh, astounding? <laughs> no, I can't. It's the it. big one. It's the big one. <laughs> Yay! Level up. Level up. Come well, on, please. Well, anyone, who, anyone who still hasn't watched A History in Skulls. They what have are you to doing, know. man? We've brought it up like three times now. <laughs> what are you doing with your life? Watch it already. Oh, Watch it. So now we gotta go it's heal. where fuck my ass comes from. Yes, it is. It is indeed where fuck my ass comes from. Suck me. Suck my dick. Fuck my ass. Oh, yeah, oh you don't shit. Need life couple noodles. life noodles. <laughs> Yeah, oh fuck god, that. Jesus. Okay. Use the escape rope. No, I didn't want to open the present again. I keep kneeing this right trigger. I get it. No, that's oh. the tree. What does the right trigger do? It's the same thing as the left trigger. It's just check area. And so that you'll see, periodically see, no problem here. So it's not the it's A like, button to do that? Is, no. Uh, well, the I A button was, opens up the menu oh. to do it. It's like a shortcut. Huh. It's like... Interesting controls. Those speed. macros. Yeah. <laughs> No oh. macro though. Fucking Macros and things. cheese. Goddamn Romuel coming at you. Macaroni yeah, and looks like cheese. That. Oh, I got side flash. When do I get this? I kind of want mac and flash. cheese. DK flash. What'd you say, Josh? I want mac and cheese. Again. He does. Oh, I want coffee. Do you want to go? No. God damn it. I didn't think <laughs> that would work. Are you a goer? Uh, go? 
Oh yeah, they're they're weak to ice. That's right. How long ago did we start this episode? Uh, like twenty minutes ago. No, it was when we beat no. the boss. Yeah, it was a little while ago. Was, Wait, this episode? No, we just short. started it because Brandon. We said started yeah. it right intro. after beating the boss, right? Yeah. And that was like five minutes ago, maybe. It was a very short period. Like of run time. it for another five. It will go. Minutes. Yeah, I'm info just info trying to like I just don't know how long ago it was. <sighs> That's I teddy bear. The time when I ended it. Wonderful. Wonderful. We're leveling you up. All right, I'm buying everyone a cool cat shirt. Can you please? Will you really? I feel like that would run you quite a bit of money. <laughs> Depending how much they are. This is going to be rough. Uh, I should find that out. How much are cool cat shirts? I'm sure they're limited run. Nah, man. I'm sure they're, like, disgusting. Please, please, God, please. <laughs> please, God. I ho fucking hate the trees, man. Every day with the trees. Look how fucking... Ugh. Look at the face. Man, did you got It's like no me health. if I was a tree. Yeah, she started off really short. Really low on... God, the website is so fucking just horrible 90, looking. early 2000s. It really is. It's like 2003, like, fucking Facebook. So I guess the shirts are $17, and they're sold through eBay. Oh, my of course. God. It says there's more than 10 available. Jesus. And then it's $5 shipping. Yeah. Geez. $5 shipping. $5 foot long. For, like, 22 bucks. It would, it would be worth it if it was, like, a good shirt, but it looks like it's just, like, an iron-on, basically. Yep. You would, you shouldn't expect anything less. I want the shirt Cool <laughs> Cat wears. I like that better. Oh, the just one the one that's just the same? <laughs> yeah. You could easily make that in, Maybe like, five minutes. I, it's I gotta make a an iron-on. I gotta make a shirt for uh, Brandon's that kid tournament. That sand and Cool Cat Oh, yeah, that kid kicks sand and Cool Cat's, <laughs> kick, kick, kick. <laughs> kick cool cat's <laughs> <laughs> Abysmal. <laughs> I wish Eric Estrada could was like open and available for parties. I bet he was like drunk during that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he was clearly drunk during that. He's like, I have to do this shit to support to do myself. This. I'm pretty sure both of them were drunk. They were just sitting there having. Wow, I did. Like, like, someone just walked up. Was like, can we film you for this? And they like hand them each like fifty dollars. Like, okay, yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> yeah. Look ambiguously. We're doing it, guys. But yeah. There was one time where I got uh, Paula on this system, and I just died immediately. And I just, just to, like, get back. And I didn't level her up at all. And then I realized that it just hurt me in the long run. <laughs> get back to where you want to belong. Yeah. How'd you know? How did you know? You're Paul McCartney. I am now. And you are Vladimir Lennon. Vladimir John Lennon. Vladimir John Lennon. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're doing this, guys. But yeah, what's your tag again for the tournament? Uh, Galois. Oh, yeah. yeah. Len Lenois? Galois. Galois. G A L O I S. O I S, yes. Galois. So, what happened? You used to always Lenoir. say Galloway when you used to pronounce it back in the GameCube chat days. Yeah, it was Galloway. That was when he was a child, okay? I was, like, trying to figure now. out the pronunciation for it, and I knew that it's it was, French. like, a W thing. But Galois. now I, I, like, I looked back at it and I realized I was pronouncing it wrong. And now you know how to speak. French. I do know. I know a bit more pronunciation. Who is Lan -wa, though? Lan? What? Okay, guys. Let's pray that the mushroom does not get attached to my head. I hope it Everyone does. Everyone join hands. I'm, I'm, I'm uh, hoping that. Oh, Daniel Lanwa, who's worked with Brian Eno. <laughs> That's where I recognize <laughs> Every him Every fucking from. game. We're always one <laughs> step behind him, man. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> God, look, I need a shirt look at my laughs like, on the fucking... <laughs> I need a shirt with, like, Brian Eno's face next to Trevor's face. I'd probably make out with <laughs> and what, him. I want a, no, I want one of Brian Eno's whole self and Trevor one step behind him. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to catch and up. And it says <laughs> always one step behind him on the shirt. That would be great. That would be great. That would be fantastic. Wait, we need to start making our own shirts. We need to get a shirt machine. We should all pitch in and a get a shirt giant machine. This thing is so shirt expensive. I am buy all shirt the shirt. We probably could do it in your little shed, though. If that thing's or just like empty. Like anywhere? Like in my room or something? No. Like, shirt machine. We could do it like somewhere you my go. My friend Tommy Oliver has one, and he did it out of his room. Does he have a shirt machine? Like, does he have a, a fucking silk screen? He has like a thing that... He's got smoke it's screen, like a press. silk screen. Like a press. He oh, has like a fuck, shirt press. I don't want to do those. A shirt press. I want to do silk screen. 
but that sounds like it'd be much harder. Silk Road. And it's a lot more work, but uh, didn't something happen with the Silk Road? Oh yeah, yeah the, the guy, guy that got it, life got in it. prison. We don't necessarily need our shirts to last forever. I do. Let's order our shirts from the Silk Road. I just want to make. I just uh, my my current ambition is to make a bunch of shirts based on shirts that anime characters wear. Oh, I see. Guys, but, we got a backstage like, pass. Not ones that are like, like cosplay shirts. Oh, like, like slice of life. It's anime the guy. Shirts. What again? Already? Yeah. At the chaos. The pictures end. taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say fuzzy pickles. Fuzzy, fuzzy pickles. pickles. Wow, what a great photo. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. So does he, like, Shock the do monkey. anything else in the story? Ooh. Like, does he play into anything? Or no. is he just there? You'll see. Oh, You'll this see. Daniel Lanois That's also worked with Bob Dylan. Oh, they owe me a lot of money. They'll stay here until they pay me back. They might be here for 100 years, unless you decide to pay off their debt. Oh, yeah, this guy. Whose debt are you trying to pay off? The band that you saw. The, what is their band I don't name? Remember the something band. five. The Runaway Five. Runaway I think five. I wasn't paying attention when you saw a band. Wait, how do I? Use Were you too to busy pass? shocking the monkey? I was. I was one pixel away from talking to her, actually. Here you go, hurry. You're just in time to see the Runaway Five show. Woo, we're going to go see a band. What do they sound like? Oh, they sound jazzy, man. They sound... Yeah, you gotta listen. Yeah, you They gotta... sound like the Proto-Men? No. <laughs> oh, wait, they're changing clothes. Wait, I gotta figure out. Hey, do really? they sound... You know what I'll bet they're based on? Do you ever listen to Pizzicato 5? Uh, yeah, I have, actually. I think they were around this time. They the also look 90s. like the Blues Brothers. Oh, they're all dudes. Never mind. They're probably yeah. not based off of Pizzicato. They're a jazz band. Although Pizzicato 5 did have all dudes at one point, I think. I had $10,000. I could like, pay off my debt to move on to the next town. I wonder if our bus still runs. It may be rusted out. Well, yeah, in the old days, there are lots of dudes. Trevor, I think you'd like Pizzicato 5. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? He knows everything about us, man. There's at least one song by them that you've probably heard. Yeah, that's right. Futurama. Okay, I'm going to turn the volumes just so I can listen to their music. Baby Love Child. Do you know that song? No. Right. World's greatest bluesman, the Runaway Five, and here they come! Oh yeah, baby! This is the best show. <gasps> oh, yeah, yeah, they're bluesy. That's right. I forgot it's Mario and Luigi. I think in Mother Three, that band oh, is. Oh yeah, jazzy. it is Mario and Luigi, isn't it? No, what are you talking about? It's it's the Mario Brothers. Oh, uh, what did you do? It always happens when you hit the the, the screen, it's and I just put my thumb really? down. Yeah. It's Mario, Mario, and Luigi. Why Mario. do you have a? Dun, 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 dun. I love how the Runaway Five, but there's six of them. Don't worry about that. The bass player is just a stand-in. Yeah, he does look like kind of off in the back. Yeah, he looks like he should be at a hotel. He looks like he's behind the keyboardist. Yeah. He's behind Stevie Wonder. He's getting laid last. Or maybe the the singers are like the same person somehow. They fuse. Yeah, they do the fusion dance like right now. Are you getting into the music, guys? Are you jamming out? I'm so jamming. These fucking MIDI tracks, dog. Woo! We just saw their show. One song. What are you talking about? It's fantastic. For some reason, I thought their other shows were a lot longer, like later in the game. Come in quick! Don't be shy. Don't come in quick. Hey, huh. Mr. Poochie Fudd, the man made. Link for you. I wonder what he wants. What does he want? So what do you think? No. Do you want to see one more show? No, I don't want to see another show. All right. Next time on Digibro. We pay off a band's debt of $10,000. Yeah. Great. Responsibilities.